What's going on? It's me, Mikey Pipes, with Peter the Sponge. Sponge. How do you like that name? Oh, that's not bad. Eh, it's not so bad. You prefer pretty Peter Pan, Peter Piper? Uh, I think the most like ironic one is Peter Piper. Peter Piper. Well, let's keep it Peter Piper. <laughs> so I come to the shop this morning, and I get a package. And it looked like it was coming from the USDA. See? See that? Looks like it's USDA, but it's not. And it contained this thermal imaging camera that plugs into the bottom of your iPhone. It's pretty cool. It's pretty cool. So we're going to try to use that today. Uh, we have a very short, easy day today. We're going to uh, give someone an estimate to replace a laundry sink. We're going to replace a vary valve on a steam radiator that's not even about a week old and it's just letting out crazy amounts of steam just continuously. So they go bad every so often, very rare. And the highlight of today and the video will be the replacement of a double check valve on yesterday's job. But we're also gonna add in a, uh, um, a three quarter by half inch T to bring him a frost free hose faucet to the back of the house. So a little bit of plumbing today. Uh, we did get word that his tankless water heater with the failed heat exchanger uh, was condemned by the manufacturer. They called me around 5.30 yesterday afternoon while I was hanging out in the backyard in the sun by the pool. Um, and uh, yeah, it was a great conversation. <laughs> so that's all I'm gonna say. <laughs> all right, please smash that thumbs up button. And if you haven't done this already, consider subscribing. Uh, and if you're feeling like in the giving mood, you feel like you wanna give some charity or sadaka today, Check out the Mikey Pipes Philanthropy YouTube channel. Please subscribe to that. And a great announcement is that yesterday, the channel was approved for the YouTube Creator Program. That means I can now monetize the videos and 100% of all proceeds will go to the Mikey Pipes Philanthropy Charitable Organization, a recognized 501c3 charity with the IRS. We're gonna deliver free and or very, very affordable Plumbing, heating, and cooling services to those who are in bad financial shape and just can't afford, you know, a, a bill. You know, whether it's a repair or you never know, it could be an installation. If you need, if you know anyone who needs help, give me an email, Mike at MikeyPipes.com. Good morning. Good morning. So yeah. one of them uh, is broken, huh? I guess. All right. Let's get this thing out of your way. That thing? No, it's all good. We'll get around it. Yeah, it sucks. Sometimes I guess you get a bad one out of the batch, but all right, you know, that's what uh, we're here for. How's everything else? Good? Everything's perfect. It's working well, all the rooms, no more little catch little, uh, no little plastic contraptions to catch the water. No grips. Excellent. Excellent. Really dodged the bullet. How's the water meter looking on the... Uh... It's good. It was at two and it stayed at two. Good, good. Good. I'm sure you still have the heat on at night. I uh, what I do is I I turned it down on the other side, the side you said not to. <laughs> gotcha. <laughs> the valve. So we have the old one off. I'm gonna put the new vary valve in. This is uh, the angle one. And rule of thumb: size of the radiator justifies the opening of the slide because it's adjustable, and that will allow the amount of air out based on how it's open. See if he catches it. Struggle a little bit there. Old cast iron radiator. You can do it. Got the old one off. Come on, Peter. You can do it. There we go. Oh, oh spoke too soon. <laughs> oh, come on, you can do it. There we go. No pressure. There we go. <laughs> there we go. Nice. All right, ladies and gentlemen. So we finished off that recall. I should build very well for that nonsense, by the way. <laughs> but that's what markup of material is for, you know, to warranty and guarantee the job. If, you have, if you're buying something for $20, you sell it for $20, there's something wrong. <laughs> Just saying. All right, so we're going now to uh, a, an existing client in Rosedale, which is in the uh, corner of uh, south eastern corner of Queens, over by JFK, Hugs Nassau County, which is where we're out of. And the uh, customer um, wants a, a laundry sink to be replaced. And they also have a leak. So uh, Peter and I are going to go say hi and, um, you know, secure the job. Yeah. Let's go do it. It's like he was by the door waiting for us. Hey, dude, here to give you an estimate to look at a laundry sink. You got a leak too, right? Yeah, hey, I got a leak, but I think I might. Come on in. Okay, thank you, thank you. Oh, hello, little doggy. <laughs> oh, my God, you're tiny. 
Oh my God, I can put you in my pocket. Seriously, I can put you in my pocket. How old is, what is this? He's been nine years old. He's nine years old? Oh my God, what's his name or her name? Prince. Prince, you're the prince of the house. Oh, ain't that for sure. Nine years old, full of energy, you know, and quiet too. Yeah, All right, Prince, we gotta go to work. You don't bark and step on his foot. <laughs> oh, he's tiny. He's tiny enough for that's for sure. How you guys doing? We're doing good. How you been? Good, good, good. Are you, you guys want to pour it now? I think Mike came over. Yeah. Yeah, you can get something for me. I, I think I can clean this. I, I, I'll see if you place it, but I think I can scrape it and clean it. Okay. But I, but I do have a, a leak. On the okay. on the faucet, I see. On the hot side. Yeah. I don't have a turn off valve, but I guess I have to turn all the water off in the house. That sucks. Why no valve? I never bothered to do it. I bought the house years ago and you never had one. So. Do I hear an oil furnace running right now? Yeah. Oh my god. I know. <laughs> oh my god. It's in the works. <laughs> it's in the works. Oh man, you know, we do that too. We got gas in the house. You do? Yeah, of course. All right. So you crank this thing really down a lot, right? All right. So, Peter, let's grab the, uh, grab the tool bag. And we're gonna take this thing apart. I think we have some washers. I think the truck is uh, is locked. We're gonna try to take this thing apart and rebuild it. All right. The seat looks okay. We'll take a look at that washer. Ain't nothing left of it. Damn. That's rough. Take the little set screw out of there. And normally, wow. Normally, I would say you can flip the washer around right, and put it in there like that. Okay. But in this case, there's a little crack right there, so you're not going to be able to. I'm pretty sure we have some washers in the truck. We have to go find it. And worst case scenario, I'm going to put a ball valve in right here. Okay, let's go find washers. I have to like this little dog. I really do. Hi. You're a little dog. I, I could put you in my pocket and no one would know. Look at this. Hi. And you're quiet. You're very, very quiet. Hi. You know, you know, you know how to sit? Do you sit? No, you don't sit. You're so excited. <laughs> He's so quiet too. My God. <laughs> Hi, Peter. Hello. All right, we're at our next job. We have to go in the hole. Uh -oh. And don't leave home without it. We'll use this as a flat screwdriver. There we go. Now we're in. <laughs> oh my God. All right, there's a backflow prevention device right there. It's all pro improperly installed. We're gonna hook this up the right way. I'll tell you, it's not fun. Let me go back in there. And the only way to get in there is by opening the valve. It sucks, but off camera, we are ready to replace the backflow prevention device. There's the hole of it, look at that. That is insane. That's insane. So, ladies and gentlemen, we're gonna go into the abyss. Once I'm into the abyss, we're gonna drill a hole. So come on guys, let's go. Ah. My brand new Milwaukee M18 drill is getting dirty. She's getting dirty. Uh oh, we need any light. Okay, light. let there be light and there was light. All right, I got my Bosch gloves. Love Bosch, ladies and gentlemen, love Bosch. Official sponsor of the Mikey Pipes Philanthropy Charitable Organization. Oh God, help me. Ugh. Okay, now. Ow, ow, no, it fell off my knee, my knee pads, it fell off my kneecaps. Um, this, hold on, hold on. The smallest size, but how many perfectly? Well, that'd be perfect, but yeah, that's the smallest size? Yeah, it's okay, how's your hole? Family. Yes, okay, let's go ladies and gentlemen, let's go. We wanna be above that air flood vent. By the way, she's a leaker. That's nasty, by the way. We'll get to that later, though. That's nasty. Feel free to fast forward a few seconds, but I'm going above that grill. And that's storm, uh, stormwater grill, see? There, 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 over there, over there. That's a stormwater grill. We're in a flood zone, so when hurricanes come, Crawl space gets flooded with storm water. Oh, God. Oh. I gotta stop laying down the job. We have a sink right above here, so I'm gonna take off. Oh, there's a refrigeration lines. Really? What is this? Oh, 
Oh no, that's refrigeration line. There's the other one, see? Okay, we're gonna drill a hole right there. Right in there, I made a hole right there. Peter's got the screw gun, we're gonna take off this flood grill. That way I can see him and he can see me and I don't gotta go all the way back over there again. I'm probably gonna have to go back over there again anyway. Because it's never as planned. He's going to take this, take the screws out, and it's not going to want to come out. And I'm going to be mad. Like, what the F? I got something in my eye right now. There's something in my eye. Is it out? One more screw. One more screw? Okay, and then I'll, I'll give it a nice swift kick in the, in the rear end, and it'll pop out. Yeah. Don't, don't strip the screws. Yeah. Is that all of them? Uh, yeah. You know what? Oh. It's not going to open crazy wide just because there's a... What? A, um... Hold on. You said it was four screws, Peter. Yeah, all the screws are out. So let's take this thing out, no? Okay. Yeah. Wow, look at that. Hi. How's it I'm good. <laughs> Peter, mm -hmm. you're, you're going to drill through vinyl siding, mm -hmm. right? Yeah. So when you're drilling through vinyl siding, you need to drill it first in reverse. Okay. All right? You know what I'm talking about? Uh, I've seen Danny and Mike do it. You know why? <coughs> you know why? Is it to get the grooves made? No, so you don't you don't shatter the, the vinyl. Okay. So there's okay. the hole. Are you done with that? Okay. We're using the spider. Nice spider. Okay, reverse it. Have it in hammer? No, no hammer. You're going through. You're going through wood. Don't be like the other mic using a hammer drill going through wood. It doesn't do anything. Reverse. Okay, go. Go. Reverse all the way. Go. Come on. Okay, all right. Now, take it out. No, oh, take it out. Take that stuff out of there. The cocky. <laughs> How's Nana Claire doing? Uh, oh, better. Yeah, better. She's okay. Out of the Excellent. Now we'll drill that hole. Okay. Go. Ah. What's going on? See, so you're you're doing all that drilling, right? Mm -hmm. And nothing's happening. Right, because you already went through all the wood, and you, now you're not going anywhere. Yeah. All right. So hot. That's what she said. <laughs> it's so hot. Is it all out? All the cockies out of there? Yeah. Good. Put that back on there. Oh, the wood's brand new, and now it's old. Get a hang of it eventually, Peter. <laughs> Rome wasn't built overnight, yeah. and neither was your education. Okay. Learn something new every day. See, now you're fighting with it. Cool. All gone? Yep. Very nice. Now you have a nice hole. Beautiful. How's your hole? Incredible. I was able to get some of these blue fins and lead free, made in Indonesia. Well, it's better than South Korea. <laughs> anyway, um, <laughs> this this little thing here, right? It says, you know, remove. Hose in freezing weather, right? You would think it would should be there so you could easily see it, right? Like a nice, yeah. like a nice little plate for it, but no, because it doesn't line up. So you got to put it like that. I guess maybe in Indonesia they do things a little differently. Anyway, at the end of this, I'm using a half inch uh, PEX, crimp PEX, which is PEX B, to female adapter. Now I just have a, a random length of just one inch, that, uh, sorry, half inch that we had in the truck. I'm gonna shove it in there. Get this all the way in, of course, like that, boom. And that's gonna line up right there. Okay, and then we're gonna take a couple screws. We're gonna secure that right there. 
Easy peasy. All right, so I didn't send the screws all the way on because I don't want to smush in the siding. All right. Looks nice. You know, if this was a replacement while they were doing siding, you'd have one of those trim boxes there, and it's nice flat, but looks nice there. I wasn't drilling through this, the foundation wall, which is, appears to be cinder block, which is, ugh, whatever. But there that is. So now we need to make our connection inside. Beautiful. Look at that. Make our connection inside. Oh, uh, there's a water line right there. Let's do that. All right, so let's go in here into the abyss. I got water lines right here, so easy peasy. Let's see if I can find the valve, maybe for this these uh for this kitchen sink, which is right above us. But I don't think I'm gonna get that lucky today. There's Peter trying to get the bucket of water out. Uh, he did it. All right, <clears throat> come on, baby, get in there. Ow. Wish I had elbow pads too. F me, man. And I'll show you that leak in a little bit. But let's work on this, this domestic water line right now. Uh, right there, and it's gonna be hot. So that's gonna be cold. <laughs> I took a bath! <laughs> They exploded. <laughs> it was pressure. Yeah. There was pressure in them pipes. <laughs> There's pressure in them pipes. Like I'm wearing my knee pads. You gotta keep my gotta keep my boots dry. <laughs> Your face is fucked. See? <laughs> I, I know my face is fucked, but this is how I love you. No homo, bro. This is how I love my community. There's nothing I won't do for you guys. You guys should have saw that though. Should yeah. we try to redo it? <laughs> Should we do it? <laughs> Alright, what I did was there's a hat this this line right here is three quarter, right? It went to half inch. Right here, that's the kitchen sink line. So we're going to put a three a half inch T right here, right? And we're gonna pick up our half inch thing right here. So let's get damn, I'm getting my shit all wet. Let's get some pet uh, some crimp rings. Yep. And I'm gonna I'm gonna crimp that together. I was just about to get out of the crawl space, but I need to show you guys something. Let's go see. Let's go for a walk down. Let's go. Do not. Do not. If you pass, go collect two hundred dollars. Let's go to the. Let's go to the reading room around here. Ready? Let's. Go. I need to show them something. Remember that leak? Well, let's not forget this leak. Okay. I have cocky right there. That's wet cocky, and I know the layout kind of of this house a little bit. But let's pull out this piece of insulation. Oof. Holy sh! We have, you know what? You see this little box right here? This box, this box is the condensate pump. Look at all that mold and mildew on the subfloor. This box is is a recessed hole or box on the floor where the condensate pump is for the high efficiency furnace that's upstairs. Oh, I'm sorry. It is no good. Look at that. That is, oh God, it's gross. So unfortunately, the homeowner's not home right now. He gave us access to the garage remotely, but uh, we're gonna clean everything up and uh, hit him with the bad news that, um, you know, he got effed by hacks. Yeah. Just like those AC condensers outside. Look at this. Look at this. These are two Lux Air condensers. They're three tons each. I can't even, I can't get my hand, oh, I can get my hand in there. Actually, no. I can't get my arm in there. Look at this. That's how close these are to the wall. What were they thinking? Are they stupid or something? You got a haircut. I did. Oh, very nice. Yeah. Buzz cut, let's see. No, I have had haircut. Let's see, let's see. I'll show you tomorrow. I'm not here tomorrow. It's the second days of the last day is the Passover. That's right. I can't wait. You know what I'm doing Thursday night? I'm bringing the whole family to King Umberto's in Elmont. It's very, very smart. Very, very smart. But look at this. Look at that. What are they thinking? Look at this. This is retarded. They weren't, thinking. they weren't thinking. So when it gets like 85 and above outside, these things don't work. They stop working. They can't effectively extract heat outside from inside the house. All right, let's put everything back together. We'll clean up. We'll test our hose, our hose cock. It's actually a silk cock. Frost free hose force. Should I, uh, oh. don't want to get my boots wet. <laughs> So, top Don, <laughs> top Don. Let me load the music. I don't want to get any copyright claims. 
Look at this. So this is that uh, thermal imaging camera that uh, plugs into the, the port on the bottom of an iPhone. Looks pretty cool. All right. Let's see. Comes in a nice little case. Very nice. Let's see. Oh, cool. a little cleaning microfiber cloth. Very nice. It plugs right into the iPhone, huh? Mm. On my iPhone? Sure. Right, here's my phone. All right. Yeah, the my Porsche app. Will it fit in with a case on? That's the question. Yeah. Snaps into place. Okay. You automatically get a, an alert here. It says the accessory TC002 uses an app you do not have installed. Would you like to get it from the app store? Wow. It's like plug and play. Like it's Windows. That's awesome. Look at that. A freaky. It says the dark has no secrets. That is that is some dark ship right there, ladies and gentlemen. The dark has no secrets. So let's open that up and uh, look at there. Okay, so it's calibrating. So, so far, like pretty cut simple. Let's see. What's in Celsius right now? It's in Celsius, yeah. Tell them we're, we're, we use the imperial system here in America, yeah. the United States of America. Oh, that's cool. You can change the. Oh, the color. Oh, wow. Look at that. That's pretty cool. That's pretty cool. You know what? You should probably screen record. Yeah, let's screen record. Hi, it's me, Mikey Pipes.